Hello everyone, welcome to the Modern Stacker. I wanted to jump in and give a quick video to talk about the, the, the silver drop because I think everybody's talking about it, but I want to give an explanation as to why it happened. So uh, we've talked about this before. Robots do crazy and strange things when they're put under pressure. And I think this is the pressure line that we want to look at right here. This is the 200 moving day average, which basically averages the ups and downs over the last 200 days, the rise and fall of silver prices. And as you can see, what we're looking at is uh, it dipped below the 200 day moving averages and computer algorithms know that whenever this happens, it, you drop and that's just it, you sell. And so that's what happened. We saw a nice big sell off. And down here in the bottom of this corner here, we have the relative um, strength index, the RSI, and you can see here silver is, I mean, the price is significantly on the low side anytime you see it in the low side it means it's undersold undervalued um, and then if it's on the high side it's oversold or overvalued uh, and you can kind of use this as a gauge to see what's going on another little interesting little tidbit apparently the perth mint had some low uh, uh, sales posted or something like that so gold and silver are kind of attached to the hip but that's these are some of the reasons why we're seeing uh, the price fluctuation. Uh, if you look at gold, it's also doing kind of, you know, an interesting thing, but it's still above. I, I actually, I don't know if I have the 200 day on. Yeah, well, anyway, you can, you can take a look at that. But the thing that I really want to uh, point attention to here is the gold to silver ratio. This, if you're, if you're an active stacker, like I am, this is the time to be back in the truck up and taking a serious look at it. Cause I don't see this. Uh, I, I haven't seen this in a while, so <laughs> this is for me. This is exciting because I'm always actively buying uh, precious metals, and that's again not a, not a financial advisor, just a dude on YouTube who likes to talk about shiny things. So uh, hopefully this video was helpful. Again, this may be a time to be back in the truck up if that's uh, something you're interested in. I think this was uh, the computers having their day of panic, uh, and I, I wouldn't read too much into it except for the fact that. Uh, this could be a good opportunity to pick some stuff up, especially if you've been thinking about it. So hopefully this was helpful. Uh, click that like button if this was, and uh, consider subscribing. And if, uh, if you do, I'll see you again next time. In the meantime, keep on stacking. Take care.